Hello friends, welcome to Continental Desi Kitchen. In today's video, we're going to see how to make chicken meatballs Manchurian, that too with homemade meatballs, which will be so delicious and flavorful, just like restaurant style. And you can enjoy this recipe with fried rice or noodles. So friends, let's get started with this yummy recipe. So for this recipe, I've taken here half kg of minced chicken and now I'm going to add some ingredients which will make our meatballs delicious and flavorful. Here goes some minced garlic. I have used here three large garlic pots. Then goes some finely chopped ginger and green chilies. You can add chilies according to your spice level. Next goes one small onion which has been finely chopped. Some finely chopped cilantro or coriander leaves. Some finely chopped spring onions. For seasoning, I'll be adding 1 4 teaspoon of chili flakes. Slightly more than half teaspoon of salt or as per taste. Half teaspoon of black pepper. Half teaspoon of dark soy sauce. Then goes one egg and 1 fourth cup of corn flour. This will help to bind all the ingredients together. And finally, around 1 teaspoon of refined oil. And now with clean hands, we'll mix all the ingredients so that they are well combined. If you find the mixture moist or loose, you can add 1 more tablespoon of corn flour. This should be okay now. Just roll a small portion and see if it binds well. So our mixture is ready now to make meatballs. Next, grease some oil in a plate where we will keep the meatballs as well as on our palms. And with the help of an ice cream scooper, I will start making the meatballs so that they are of same sizes. Gently roll them in this way and keep them in the plate. And the same way I will make all the meatballs. In my earlier video of chicken meatballs in hot garlic sauce, some people had asked about the recipe of homemade meatballs and from this video you can see how to make meatballs at home easily and you can even store them frozen in a ziplock bag for about a week. So I have finished preparing all my chicken meatballs and now time to fry them. For that heat sufficient oil in a karhai or deep fry pan and when the oil is hot, we will add the chicken meatballs one by one into the hot oil and on medium flame we need to fry them until they turn deep golden brown from all the sides. After a few seconds we will flip the meatballs so that they are evenly fried from all the sides. And by now, our chicken meatballs are fried deep golden brown, so I will take them off and keep them aside in a plate. And friends, these meatballs are so delicious and yummy that you can enjoy them right away as snacks or starters with your favorite dip. And now we shall make the Manchurian gravy for that heat up pan and into it goes 1 tablespoon of refined oil. And when the oil is hot, goes 1 medium onion which has been finely chopped. Next goes some minced garlic. I have used here 4 to 5 large garlic pots. Then goes some minced ginger. Now saute the onion, ginger, garlic for a while until they turn golden brown in color. And by now the onion, ginger, garlic has been fried well and has turned golden brown. At this stage, we'll add the white part of spring onions. Saute them for a while. And we'll quickly season this with a pinch of salt or as per taste and a pinch of black pepper. Next goes 1 tablespoon of tomato ketchup. Half teaspoon of dark soy sauce and one tablespoon of sezwan sauce. Now mix all the ingredients well so that they are well combined. Keep the flame on medium. 
and now i will add little water to form a gravy like consistency give this a mix and as the gravy starts to boil we will add a small bowl of corn flour slurry this will make the gravy thick mix this well check for the salt proportion and at this stage we will add the fried chicken meatballs into the gravy now coat the meatballs with the manchurian gravy so that they can absorb all the flavors of the spicy and tangy sauce and now we will cover and let the meatballs simmer in the gravy for just 2 minutes it's almost 2 minutes now and our chicken meatballs manchurian is almost ready but before turning off the flame i will add some chopped spring onions that's it our dish is now ready to be served hot and friends here goes our yummy and delicious homemade chicken meatballs in manchurian gravy enjoy them hot with fried rice or noodles so friends i hope you enjoyed watching my today's video if yes give a like and share your feedbacks as well as subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet for more yummy recipes see you soon in my next video until then bye bye take care and stay safe